people, welcome back to my channel, salut les amis, bon retour sur la chaîne, hola, bienvenue dans mon canal, konnichiwa, watashi no channel ni yokoso. Today I'm coming with four fall outfits that probably I would love, I would like, so if you want to see the rest, keep on watching. This is my first look. All my looks are really unique because you either like it or you hate it. But for this first look, I really love the fact that I could pair up my Robin Hood boots with my skirt. The way to just pair it in a way that is still trendy but it's still being me. Uh, regarding the trends that you're gonna see a lot of like long dresses or long skirts with like boots like that. It's really cute and it's a really really nice contrast black and burgundy. The top is still really feminine, really florally so you kind of still that like kind of summer vibe and then you have a skirt with the slits and then the boots. The other thing that I love about the skirt is that because it's really long on me and I'm short, the slit just reveal my legs a little bit, kind of give me a lot more height if I could say it. It's definitely something that you can wear to a date. So let me know what you think about it. I love it. Just love it, love it, love it, love it. I think it's cute. Yes. And <laughs> Hello people! This is my second look and uh, again you might hate it, you might like it. It's hard to have an in middle with this outfit to be honest. I'm trying to cheat a little bit here. here. I have a dress, a shirt dress that I bought at Zara recently, a couple of days ago. Just wanted to show you another fall look that would be amazing whenever you want to run errands thing after work in general you can go have a drink you can go take a walk it's really easy breezy i want to say um some type of boots here <laughs> i wanted to belt it up a little bit but i saw that it was just not a great look with this shirt dress i don't feel like i'm swimming in it but it's okay because i have heels you don't want to look smaller than you actually are and you don't want to look bigger than what you actually are either funny thing is that i wanted to put like my robin hood type of boots so if you don't know what i mean by it just check my last video you will quickly understand but pretty much it's the chunky the bigger that's what i call robin hood boots pretty much it was way too short and i really wanted to have long boots so that we just don't see my legs at all. Wanted to go with that kind of look. A new bag from Zara as well, which is like more in the mustard type of vibes. Is the pop of color for the whole outfit. Other chains going on around the sleeves and around the neck. It reminds you of the vintage trend going on. Love it, love it, love it. Really edgy really different but i love it <laughs> super comfy as well so uh, something that i would put with it as outerwear is night biker jacket from h&m it's my basic when it comes to fall anyways black on black and then you have a neutral in the middle which is white and the pop of color reminds you of fall because of the shade going <laughs> We are on the third look and we still bringing the animal print going on with these boots you can see there's a lot of like vibe for fall going on well it's a point of the video right no comment here animal prints i have a hard way with it but when it comes to accessories it really really goes much better in my cup of tea and in my tea in general i have a color it's literally it's a really nice colorful yet a little bit dark outfit really wanted to add a pop of color but still a fall color and still staying in the neutral look i don't have a lot going on in terms of prints the only statement piece are the boots it's not as much in your face really nice way to style these boots the good point is that because they're neutral you can actually 
add colors. The only thing that I wouldn't suggest, maybe if you're not too much used to it, is to add other prints. So you can go with the red, the burgundy, the burnt orange. The other statement piece, they're gonna bright by themselves, they're gonna be the stars of this show, and you're not gonna have to do much with it. I wish I had longer legs, but I don't, so I have to chill a little here. So I'm gonna go with something pretty short when it comes to these boots because they're right higher than my ankle, shorter than my legs quite a bit. So either I go with something really long so that it covers my boots or I go with something really short so that we can see some legs, you know. I would add something more just because I feel a little bit naked on the shoulders so it would be ta -da! my blazer. <laughs> you let me know what you think. Let me know if you like this outfit. I love, love, love this outfit a lot. Okay. <laughs> my last look. I took my dress that you saw from my first video like last week, tied it with like some sneakers. I still want to keep it a day look just to avoid to be too dressed up because of the style of the dress. You want to actually dress it down a little bit and that's what I did here with the sneakers. The pocket dot prints going on in the scarf as well ties in really well with the sneakers as well because it's still that white shape going on. That is sexy because of the dress but because of the sneakers it's not as much so way to just style the cheetah print scarf here the perfect way to show you what i would do with that with sneakers and with the dress as well it really fits to your body and i got an extra small it definitely made to be tied to your body like like a glove so there's not room for anything more than your own body. <laughs> I hope you liked it. It was a lot of explanation and a lot of chatty talk, which I'm doing more and more now. So I just hope you liked it. I hope you adored it. And of course, I'm gonna see you guys for the next video. And until then, have a beautiful, beautiful week and weekend. And of course, like I say all the time, smile because it's free. Bye. J'espère que vous avez aimé, j'espère que vous avez adoré, c'était une vidéo où, euh, comme d'habitude, je parlais beaucoup trop pour mon cas. Je vais vous voir pour ma prochaine vidéo, comme d'habitude, et d'ici là, je vais vous dire bonne semaine, bon week-end, amusez-vous, puis comme je le dis tout le temps, souriez parce que, bah, c'est gratuit. Bye